Goal Getting Podcast, Season 2, Episode 21. Pull out your keys and drive with passion. Got a goal and you just can't hit it? Well, fill up here and we'll help you get it. Learn the goal achievement success system here on Goal Getting Podcast. And put some gas in your goals to power you to the finish line. Let's go, friends. Rev up your engines and let's take off for success. Hey, Goal Getters, and welcome back to the show. This is your host, Tony Woodall, and I want to thank you for stopping by. Today we have a quote from the great Darren Hardy of Success Magazine. Act with more courage. Don't allow fear to turn you away from opportunities. Risk more. Take more chances. Fail more. Laugh more and love more. Thanks, Darren Hardy, for sharing these great thoughts. I'm competing in the Toastmasters International Speech Competition this week. By the time this episode airs, I will have completed the area contest for the competition. I won the Cable Car Toastmasters competition, which is our club, and move on to our area competition. My speech is entitled, Passion Has a Place. My speech is about living a passionate life. Finding this quote really hit home with me and made me think of these as the seven keys to a passionate life. Key number one is act with more courage. The important part of this quote is the word act. Action is what defines passion. Passion, without action, is just desire. It is just a wish, a thought. Acting on your dreams, your desires, takes courage. What is courage, you ask? You did ask, didn't you? I thought you did. Courage is the ability to do what others won't. Being the one to step out into the fight, the fray, when it seems like the odds are against you. Act with more courage in life. Number two, don't allow fear to turn you away from opportunities. When opportunities come their way, many people are afraid to take them on. Fear is a killer of opportunities. The fear of success, the fear of failure, the fear of poverty, these all prevent us from taking the opportunities that are presented to us and we lose the chance to be more than we are now. Don't let fear turn away opportunities from you. Number three, risk more. Risk is not just a game. Have you ever played the game Risk? We used to play Risk when I was a kid. Okay, I didn't play so much. I watched my friend Larry play after he beat me and most other kids that played with him. Risk is not a game, but maybe we should treat it like a game. People are often risk adverse. They have a very low risk appetite. They are afraid of taking risks. But risks are necessary in life if you want to grow. Life is about risks. The more risk you are willing to take in your life, your career, even in love, you can get further than those who that refuse to take risks. Don't be somebody who settles for mediocre. Number four, take more chances. We have many chances in life to do many things. We must be willing to take a few more chances when they come our way. I'm going to change this part of the quote to be make more chances, however. What I mean by this is we don't have to hang around and be ready to take chances when they come our way. What we have to do is to go out and make our chances. I thought about this on my walk this morning with my dog Sophie. She takes me for a walk on weekend mornings. It's her favorite thing to do. We did five miles this morning. I usually stop her at four, but I was in a walking mood too, so we went for five. Now Sophie is just Yorkie, a Yorkshire Terrier weighing in at five whopping pounds. Now that's a lot of walking for people, but in Yorkie steps, it's a long way. During the walk, I was thinking about my job as a community manager that I have now and other social media jobs, and that these jobs were not even in existence 10 years ago. There are so many careers that didn't exist when I was growing up. The same is true for you. I was thinking, if you have a passion, something you want and love to do, and there isn't a job or a career for that, then we should do what we can to create the industry or the job or the position that will fill that passion. Basically, make more chances. Make your own chances. Number five is fail more. Failure has always been thought of in a negative light. It's bad to fail. You're a loser if you fail. One thing that is known about most successful people is that they have failed many times before they became successful. 
Thomas Edison, the inventor of the light bulb, often talks about how he failed 10,000 times before he created the light bulb that made him famous and that made him a success. When we talk to many startup founders, we hear stories about the failures they endured as they started building their ideas. It's important to fail and fail fast. Failure isn't negative. Failure is education. You have the opportunity to learn what works and what doesn't. Fail more and fail fast. Number six is laugh more. Folks, life is short. Enjoy it. Laughter is the best medicine was and probably still is a column that was in Reader's Digest magazine when I was growing up. Laughter has been medically proven to be life-enhancing. The more laughter we can have in our life, the better we will feel and the healthier we will be. One of my favorite things is to listen to baby giggles. Laughing babies are big on the internet. Everyone loves baby giggles and laughter. They bring a smile to your face and joy to your heart. Go out and find something funny and start laughing. Number seven is love more. Love, like laughter, is medically proven to be life-enhancing. Finding someone with the same passions, the same dreams, the same beliefs is critical to finding a lasting love. When you find that person, you should share the love and love as much as you can. Spend time being with the ones you love, doing the things you love. Live more, love more. Friends, take these seven keys and unlock your life of passion. Go out today and act with more courage. Don't allow fear to turn you away from opportunities. Risk more. Take more chances. Fail more. Laugh more. And love more. Hey friends, I get a lot of my quotes from the great books that I read. And if you love to listen to books on audio like I do, I put together a deal with Audible.com to give goal-getting podcast listeners a free audiobook of your choice and a 30-day trial of Audible services to try them out. You can get access to that deal at goalgettingbook.com. That's goalgettingbook.com. Go over and pick up your free audiobook of your choice and try them out for 30 days on audible.com. Remember, it's goalgettingbook.com. I want to thank you for being on our episodes and listening to us. We want to offer you tips, techniques, and strategies to help you get the goals you set. I want you to go out, make today a great day, and we'll see you next time here on Goal Getting Podcasts.